hey, guess what? If you have concrete pavement, you have cracks because all concrete cracks because all concrete shrinks. And this goes for the exterior concrete around your home as well. If things are done right, then these cracks will occur in the joints of the concrete. These joints will either be made with a trowel when the concrete is wet, or they're made with a saw, which is cut into the top surface of the concrete just after it hardens. These joints are placed in the concrete in order to make the concrete weaker in specific places, which then controls where the concrete will crack. Now, what do you think these joints are called? Well, they're called control joints. <laughs> Clever, right? Now, there are also other joints that are usually on both ends of a concrete driveway. And these joints are a little bit wider to allow for some more movement. Those joints are called expansion joints. But I digress. That's not what I'm here to talk about. The point is you have lots of cracks in your concrete, which are all entry points for water. And water that travels underneath your concrete will carry away small amounts of soil. And that is bad because those soils are what the concrete is resting on. This happens slowly at first, but the more soil is removed, the more water will flow, which will remove more soil faster and faster, creating voids underneath. Eventually, with less soil supporting it, the concrete will sink and even snap into smaller pieces, creating more cracks, etc., etc. We've now just created a vicious cycle. The best way to prolong the life of your concrete is to limit the amount of water that can find its way underneath. So, is it a good idea to seal all those cracks and joints? Yes, absolutely yes. It's also important to do it the right way. Concrete pavement will always be moving, so you need a material that is both tough and flexible. It's also gonna be pounded on by the sun day after day, all day, every day. So it needs to be a quality material that will maintain its flexibility, its bond, and its color over time. And hey, when it's done right, sealed joints and cracks also have a nice clean look. Now, if you want help finding the right professional to seal your joints, we'll leave you a link below. If you wanna know more, you can come over to our page and watch more of our videos. Also, go ahead and smash that like button, drop a comment, subscribe, do all those great things. Let us know what else you'd like to learn about. So thanks for being here. This is Ask Engineer. I'm Kyle, and I'm out. See you later.